Hello everyone. In this session, we'll discuss sampling. We'll see sampling and understand what difference it makes in finding the probability. So, for a randomly drawn object from a population it can be done in two ways maybe with replacement that is from a set of objects like maybe let's let's take a box containing different color of uh, balls and if you are taking one uh, one ball out of it maybe it can be of any of the color let's say red so if you take if we take out red ball out of the box then the number of balls left in the box reduces and the number of red balls in the box contains contain is also reduced right so if we do not if if we put that that red ball back into the container and try to take out the next ball the number of total number of balls remain same the total number of red balls remain same and then the probability of getting a red ball is same similar as the previous one and in case we don't if we don't replace it back the number of balls reduces the number of red color ball reduces and in that case the probability of getting another red ball will actually change right so with replacement is where the drawn object is replaced rate of success for further trial remains same that is the probability of getting a red ball in the first trial will be the same in the second trial also because we are putting the ball back whereas without replacement where the drawn object is not replaced further rate of success changes right the rate of success will change now we'll see a question on this but apart from that there is one more thing to be known that is de morgan's law it is if we are like let's say e1 union e2 complement can be given as e1 complement intersection of e2 complement secondly if it is e1 intersection e2 complement then this can be given as e1 complement union with e2 complement right this can be extended to any 
to any number like it can be e1 union e2 union e3 union and so on right this can be extended to any union any numbers so let's say e1 union e2 union up to en complement will become e1 complement intersection e2 complement intersection up to e n e n complement similarly e1 intersection e2 intersection up to e n will become e1 union e2 complement and this will keep on going up to e n complement right 